All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Game Gen channel, where I am playing Oxenfree. Um, Cliffs has just taken a swan dive off of building after experiencing some bad shit. Uh, we've learned that the uh, beings, the entities which are communicating with us through the portal-like things, are the souls of the submarine that crashed off the coast of the island, and for some reason they want the elderly lady. Um, My God, is this what I? Huh. Well, yeah, now know. we know where the. Yes, I need to go up this way a bit more. So yeah, so. Hey, hey. So yeah, so I'm I, just interested to see I what the, the entities the actually want. The Dick Tower. Um, I think you mean Harden Tower. Why Please don't ruin that for me. It's all I have left. Why are they freaking out over the the um, woman? Still by... holding all your parts together emotionally. Um, kinda. Some things are slipping the rotors a little, but you know, whatever. <laughs> Any luck contacting somebody? Nope, no luck to speak of. And honestly, I thought this week was going to be a big karma dump. Well, we're all here now. Well, I mean, except Clarissa, but we're mostly all here and we'll come up with something. I hope so. The stupid radio has been what my therapist would call a negative reinforcer. Just won't work right. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. What? It's kind of, you know, it's just about... Wait, second brownie? Run, please tell me this is a joke, okay? This is a joke, right? Mmm, why would this be a joke? I'm not joking. Wait, you're not messing with us? You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, all right? It's just to level me out. It'll, it'll bring me back. You better pray to whatever God scares you the most. It does level you out, because if this screws us up, you're on summary probation. Don't say that. That's not, that's not nice. <laughs> oh, God. This thing doesn't work. Mm -hmm. Not getting anything. I'm, I'm getting hours. something, it but it's like, I don't know. Hey, Nona. Night's still going, huh? We heard you on the uh, speaker system. You got that working? That's about all I got working. Uh, sorry, I was like weird earlier. But hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. You've it's been like ghosts. Nona, ghosts are going on. The blackouts, the hallucinations, it's all been ghosts. Ghosts? Really? Yeah, and it would really help if you could just jump to the believing us part. It would save a headache. Oh! Oh, I got it! This is great! This is perfect! I know exactly what to do! Do you? Yeah, totally! It's Maggie Adler! Maggie Adler? Yeah! She has a boat! Had a boat. I mean, the boat's- Her house, okay. manor, or whatever it is, is behind a huge gate. You can see it coming up here from Main Street. No, I know, but the keys to it are here, somewhat readily available. My sister, Allie, worked at the parks office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, no, gonna... no, we are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. Hey, come on. Okay. I'm not a burnout. Well, okay. I mean, Jonas kind of does have a point here. Like, do you know there's a boat, or is this like when you knew the teachers kept liquor in the lounge? <laughs> Ouch, Come on. Savage. I was like 13 when I thought they all got drunk at lunch. This is a real thing. There's a boat at her dock. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. Sorry. Carry on. But Ren, <sighs> look at reality. You dragged us out. Uh, oh, uh, shut up, everybody. Look, here's something cool. A phone. Let's stop making Alex uncomfortable and talk about this instead. Look, Jonas, it should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. I mean, we all grew up Guys, with... you know there's no television cameras here, right? Take the energy down a notch. Alex, I am not putting my life in his hands. This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Jonas. I know you said Ren is Jesus, like harmless or whatever, already. but I'm over giving him passes. And you should be too. I don't need a pass from you. Alex is Guys, my- stop it! Stop! The collective neuroses call a truce, okay? Yes, please. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house. 
and the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, not that you wouldn't be... Yeah, a... it's not like... You know... I'm fine. Whatever. I'm ready. She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my, like, brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. You... Ugh, stop it! Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night... Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of... Keeping in oh, mind who's taller... Who do you want pick. coming with you? Jonas, let's go. Ah, <sighs> thank you. What?! First you ditched me back in town to talk to this guy about God knows what, and now that stuff's gone crazy, you're still picking him over me? Him? Him. Him? Ren, you ate another brownie. What do you expect me to do? I expect you to, like, care. <sighs> I expect you to think, hey, maybe Ren needs some support. Just... <sighs> just fine. Whatever. Have fun, you two. This isn't fun. That's the point. Oh, God. Will you just shut up? Okay. Oh Before God. things get stupid again, good luck with the whole key thing. We'll be waiting, guys. Alrighty. Oh, we need to go all the way back. All the way back to Main Street to the parks office. Okay, so we go get the key, go to Adler's house, get on the boat, and sail off into the sunset. And somehow find Clarissa, who is still somehow alive. in the middle of all of that. Cool, good plan, good plan. Good plan. Alrighty. Can catch up, Jonas. What are you? Alrighty. Okay, look. I'm gonna say I'm sorry now for what happened up there, but I do not. Want you to take it as an admission of guilt. That distinction is important because I don't think anything that I said was that off base. Hey, right, I was so just the girl on the sidewalk watching the car crash happen in slow motion. But you should nip it in the bud with Ren when we get back. Just say you're sorry. <sighs> Fine. For you, I will apologize to Ren when I see him. Look, uh, and I just want to clear the air too, just so Ren or whoever can't use it as ammo against me. But you might have heard that I uh, went to jail at some point. I never went to jail, but I did beat up a guy and get sent to juvenile detention for it and I just wanted you to know so it wasn't like a thing hanging over your head or anything why do you um why do you do it just my mom got sick and then she got real sick and then this kid Timmy Finster threw a baseball at my head and yes he was joking but I don't know I just popped yeah it was as stupid as it sounds what happened to the other guy hospitalized not for a while but you know, I tried to visit him after I got out, mm. but he wouldn't see me. My mom found out, of course, and I never really squared it with her in a way that, I don't know, things never really work out the way you want, you know? But, whatever. Sometimes they do, if you squint. Things line up, not always, but sometimes. I'm not gonna say I'm a good guy, Alex, but I'm trying to be, and that's really about all I can say. You are a good guy, Jonas. I'm a scary judge of people. I'm like a bee. I can sense stuff. <laughs> but I'm serious now. You're a good guy. Okay? Say it. I'm a good guy. Okay, alright. I'm a good guy. Let's just move on. Hmm. 
Alrighty, to Main Street. This is... I wanna... Like, this is whatever, but are you, like, religious at all? I mean, my dad said your mom wasn't, but that doesn't necessarily mean, you know... Yeah, I guess. My personal feeling is that the scientific process has given us lots of how, but not enough why, so... Yeah, my parents were Methodist, but my mom, she, like, practiced. Tonight's kinda... I guess I'm just realizing a lot of it's rubbed off on me more than I thought. But, I don't know. I was just wondering if you were. Yeah, I could see having some of that stuff could be timely now, just, um, for processing this. Like, having some armor. Some aspects of it just, um... Help me, I guess, day to day. A little. Is that? Oh my god, is that Clarissa? She's... Well, well, I was gonna say okay, but I'm not too sure about that. Clarissa, where have you been? The last time we saw you jumped out a window. I, I mean, I thought... We thought you were dead. Oh, Jesus, she has the... She's doing the thing. The eye thing. Mm. Christ, this is not... I am not getting used to this, I'll be honest. Oh, god, not again. Uh, I hate when this happens. Maybe they want to, maybe the ghosts oh. or whatever want to help us somehow? Is that the, like, point of trying to, trying to talk through us or something? Larissa, how are you, uh, doing, hun? Alex, little help over here. Jesus. Okay, okay, okay. I'm trying to, I'm trying to establish the portal. Clarissa? to help you this is oh, this oh, will oh God. help me help me how will that help me i was looking okay. forward to seeing you yes i used to dream about something like this don't you uh, there's a ghost in you right now they're they've like perverted this ghost sounds pretty scary kids better leave the night light on when you're off the little machine has no more heart than a brain no more heart is she Okay, okay, or... Oh, she's... Clarissa, are you okay? <sighs> Steady, just... just take it easy. I'm fine. I can... I'm fine. Okay, just take it slow. You've just... been through something. <sighs> Do you remember anything that happened? <sighs> I remember... waiting in Fort Milner... and seeing you. That's it? How did I get here? We... I think we were hoping you could tell us that. The usual answer to any question tonight has been, I have no idea, and sorry okay. to say, but this is no different. You really don't remember anything? No, I remember something. I remember you, with that radio, and I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Wait, it's Clarissa's turn already? Yeah, it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's turn already? I haven't even asked one question. Everyone's asking me. I get to do the asking now. Wait, what's uh, what's going on? We're back at the... What? It's Clarissa's turn? Yeah, it's Clarissa's turn. And Wait, you, what? of all people, should know what my question is going to be, because I'm not going to waste it. Alex, what did you do? Explain why me and my best friend... And you... Look, when we went into the cave, we found a thing, and I used the radio to somehow tune it in, and I think it jump-started everything. I see. I'm sorry, okay? I'm... I'm sorry. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be her fault. Of course her fault. There's no other way this story goes. <sighs> okay, Clarissa, come on. I said I was sorry. You don't have to pile on. Pile on? No, come on, Clarissa. Let's not do this right you're now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God. The town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her freaking Clarissa. forehead. And the giant, lit up, Christmas tree oh, reason why bitch, is that she? Michael is dead because of her. Because of her. It would take a very sick person to see it that way, and I would love to hear the explanation. 
Michael was gonna leave town. He was free, he was out of here, until this one convinced him to take her swimming for one last God knows what. And he drowned. He drowned in Horn Lake while this one could barely flap her off. It doesn't make it my fault! Anyone could have been there, anyone, and then they would have had to watch him die, you unbelievable prick! Fuck? Anyone wouldn't have watched him die, Alex. Anyone else would have done something. Okay, enough, seriously. This is... Clarissa, this is so... I, I can't even believe we're talking about this right now. She's... Enough! I mean it. Jonas, it, it was awful, all right? It's still awful, and I... I know. I know it's okay. I know. But right now, we're gonna break into that office, and we're gonna find the key. And we're going to go home. No. No? What do you mean, no? All the outs in three. So let's... Wait. What? Wasn't Clarissa with us like two seconds ago? That's crazy. She was... It was like she was just here. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, she was, but okay. we're looping again, so God only knows where she is now. <sighs> you know, I don't... I don't understand how what we did in that cave is making making any of this happen. Like, what are the triangles? What are the gates? Maybe tuning okay. in just Jesus knocked everything Lord. off what center a bit? <sighs> but I mean, I might as well be talking about flying carpets, because just who knows with this stuff. Okay, well, I'm not gonna... Whatever. We're here to get the key, and then we can leave and put all of this far behind us. Let's do it. The office is right here. Let's get in. Come on, Alex. This is the office, right? I'm gonna need your help with the door thing, I'm sure. Yeah, I thought I was here, or is it up there? Oh, I might be upstairs. Yep, this isn't budging. Well, the lock looks, uh, less okay. than modern. Okay. Let's just brute force it, both of us. It might splinter, but we should get in. I don't get enough breaking down doors in my life, really, so I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's see if Ren's plan was a good one or not. Cross your fingers and hold your thumbs. To sign up for the aquatics program, please register at the front desk. <laughs> <sighs> Never gets old. Uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket oh. radio, I think. But it, it's like that? there's way more stations on the dial. It says that... here's another one. It says they're wall radios. Wall stands for... wave-assisted lock. Holy ah, shit. they use um, that frequency thing, where each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. It says that you use them like identification tags. Oh, great. Let's hike it back to the gate. Oh, wait, look at this. Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Um... Maybe we shouldn't mess with it then. We came in here to steal a key to her property, Alex. We can slightly dishevel a box of her old junk. We can head back. I'm just gonna... Here, this is... To whom... Mm. Whom it should concern. This is a letter from her? This island and its history is a lie. Wow. Well, this is going somewhere. What? What could oh. that mean? I've been compelled by both forces outside my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. But now I feel any further inaction make Many truths? Shh. Inside, you'll find two wall-equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Find these beacons in the notes within and discover the true chronicle of the island. Oh, scavenger hunt! Oh, scavenger hunt, scavenger hunt! Wait. To whosoever finds the material know that I am discomfited for keeping it hidden, and ashamed for the lies I helped preserve, but also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time, and truly for the interest of time... Oh, <laughs> I've had... Oh, I've seriously had, like, dreams about this. Finding a secret, digging it up, it turning out to be a mechanical unicorn... Please do not get glassy eyes over this, okay? You, we, do not have to dig up some old lady's recycling. We can just go home. Hmm.
Okay, alrighty. So we have a WOW radio now, which will help us open doors for some reason. I don't know why. I'm not going to question it. Uh, and we are on our way to investigate Adler's residence. Um, so I think I'll leave it there. So if you like this video, please hit the like button below. If you want to subscribe to some more Game Jet material, please hit the subscribe button. And as always, until next time, this is the Game Jet, signing out.